Hey guys, it's Dan the Medic. Welcome to the channel. Now today I'm still on the Carnival Venezia and it is dinner time here at the main dining room called the Canal Grand. So what's going on is that I wasn't going to make another video guys. I have too many videos. So like I was just about to just enjoy my meal. Then I saw that they have fork legs guys. Fork legs. I love fork legs and I haven't had their Indian yet. So terrific. I'm going to get the fork legs, the Indian and the beef brisket. Terrific. All right. The bread here is always good. And I got my tap water. The sea is pretty high today. Forgive my shaking. So I get two orders of your fork legs. Fork leg, yeah. Then I'll take your brisket. Your brisket, yeah. And your Indian. Uh, no dessert. No dessert. Okay, thank you. Ooh. Hey guys. There's lesbians over here. Although, I'll have to admit, they don't look like they're too into it. Ah, thank you. The fork legs are here. All right, guys. Let's give the fork legs a try. I'm really excited. Please, like, like, all right. Mmm. Nice and hot. Mm. Mm. Tastes like chicken. You know, it tastes too much like chicken. It doesn't have the fogginess. <laughs> Where's the fogginess? <laughs> Ooh, a fog femur. I'll keep this for later. Well, now, let me try this plate. Oh, here's a dark one, guys. This one's pretty dark. Mm, it's like it's been marinated longer. This one got some tone. Wow, this is a thick one, guys. It's like a bodybuilder one. It's like, whoo, wow. Hmm. 
This one's a little more foggy. Oh, that one just fell apart. Another femur. It certainly is interesting. It tastes too much like chicken. Seven. It's missing that familiar frogginess that not. There was a buffet in Vegas called the uh, Buffet at Asia. And the few times I went, they had nice fried frog legs. And those were very froggy. You know, it butt into it. It's, it resembles chicken, but it got that nice frog texture and frog flavor. This is just very much like chicken, which is not a bad thing. They always said frog legs taste like chicken. Oh, terrific, thank you. So this is the Indian? Yes. Okay. Because of an ice cream cone? What's going on? Alright, take a closer look. The Indian and the uh, brisket. All right, so we're gonna start with the Indian. This is like such a tiny little portion. Okay, let's try the white sauce. It's very fatty, guys. Just like emulsified butter sauce. I might even say it's a little bit minty. Oh, that's weird. Never had that before. Now let's try this uh, thing here, whatever this is. Yeah. It's like a curry vegetable. It kind of reminds me of a Japanese curry flavor profile. All right, so six, seven, let's try the white rice. Seven point five. Right, brisket time. I have to tell you guys, it's looking a bit dry. 
It's uh, pretty hard to eat because the brisket acts like a sponge and as I'm chewing it soaks up all the liquid in my mouth and then I have to chew and then the, and the liquid just keeps getting soaked up and wow but the flavor is pretty good eventually when I when I get to uh, the flavor Too dry, guys. Give it a 5.5. Let's see this uh, beans over here. Beans got a hint of fishiness. Potato. But it was pretty good. All right, so now I'm gonna try to fix this, guys. The brisket may be dry, but there's some sauce on the plate, so I'm gonna break apart the brisket and let it soak up the sauce. In this hand. All right, take a look. The beef has soaked up all the sauce. Let's see how it is now. Still dry, guys. Oh, there's a piece of cheese in it. It's an improvement, but it, it doesn't fix the issue. It shouldn't have uh, cooked it so dry. It should put more liquid into the braising pan. Hmm. Well, well, I guess that's it. Thanks for watching the video. New Vegas video every Friday.